Have you ever wondered why doors creak and also why the pins wear out all the time? There's an answer for that, and that's based on math. If you look at the traditional door in this case, it has three hinges on it. And there's a mathematical formula developed in 1883 in Germany called Gruber's count, which helps you to, to determine if mechanisms are over constrained or not. So in this case, um, according to the math, it's hard to line up all those three hinges in line. So that's why doors tend to creak. Now, if you want to solve that, then if you use Gruber's, you re will replace those three hinges with two hinges, being the top one is a spherical joint and the bottom one being a spherical joint that's free to slide up and down. And according to the math, it says it's not over constrained and it's free to rotate about the axis between the two spheres. And then the answer is there is no more creak. So I installed it on my door, as you hear, there's no creak. So again, if you look at the bottom, it's just a spherical joint that's free to slide up and down. And the top, it's just a spherical joint, which takes the entire weight of the door. I wrote a book on Amazon.com. If you search in Amazon for Googler's count, which is G-R-U-E-B-L-E-R-S space count, you will find my book. So far, I've had nine five-star reviews, so please purchase it and use it and let me know what you think. As a supplement to my book, I've also created a YouTube channel with the same name. And if you search for Google's count on YouTube, you will find the picture of my book um, as an icon for my channel. There I have over 52 plus at this point in time example problems where I actually 3D printed the mechanisms and did the Google's count on each one of them to show that the formula works 100% of the time. And thank you very much for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye.